Okay, I'm making a little video response to Robert's aluminum frames. I'm in the process of making some out of uh, five by five uh, cells, and uh, here it is. You can watch other videos on how to make them. Anyway, that's that's my beginning there, and I just put it on like about a quarter inch sheet of ply board and I uh, took and split some paint sticks and silicone them down to the edges so my glass won't touch my cells and I'll show you my aluminum frames over here that I had the glass shop make out of tempered glass quarter inch tempered glass and um, they sent him off to an aluminum welder and he welded the corners for me so they'd be watertight. I want several of those, three there. And earlier I made, here, here's a completed one. Uh, they look nice. I like the um, four rows of nine, nice long panels. And I have a little box that I'm working on back here. You can order off the internet. And they were selling them on eBay, but I don't remember the site. But they're on a different site now. Anyway, and then I made some 36 by 36. This is the wood. And uh, I'll show you my charge controller. Inverter. This is Antrax inverter. It's not big enough to run my ice box. I got it running my TV and this little light here right now, but um, I got three batteries and they're deep cycle and they don't leak any acid or anything and the posts don't corrode their, um, oh, I forget the name of them. They have fiberglass and uh, they're sealed. Um, yellow top Optimus and they sent me the ROM breaker but uh, it works anyway it's for a three pole wind generator for alternating current but I just use the first switch on it works fine and this is the charge controller and I just got my own box electrical box it's a 10 to 12 and uh, I put a Coleman charge controller in it. I think they're the best. This is what that looks like. And uh, I had a little DC shunt and a physical amp meter analog. And this is my Xantrax inverter that's just too small. And if you have a charge controller, you need a breaker between the batteries and, and the inverter. Anyway, I'm going to take you outside and show you the rest of the panels that I have up, but the sun's already went past, so it's only going to make it about five amps right now. Oh, cut off box. And I have cable, but it's not fine stranded. And I recommend five stranded, or they do. It carries more current. This is THHN cable. Here's my aluminum frame. Ones I made some square ones. I don't like those as well as the long ones. But they work too, same. And both making together about five amps. Got the cells off of eBay. Anyway, there they are. That's my first attempt. Of course, I bought ones that were already had the corners broke off of them, and I, I broke a few of them myself too. Anyway, thanks for watching.